Today we travel to the northern part of Ghana, where approximately 70% of the local inhabitants earn their livelihood in the agricultural sector. Due to the dry climate and ineffective farming methods, the yields in this district can be low. Africa Report speaks to the Savannah Farmers Marketing Company, who helped these farmers optimize their agricultural output. These farmers have all along been supported with extension services, with a view that that will help farmers to improve upon their incomes. But after 20 or more years, those activities in, in terms of just extension services did not translate into improved incomes for the farmers. And the missing link was marketing. So this was what brought about the idea of setting up a, a company that will be in, in charge of marketing farmers' produce. The key to success in improving agriculture in this area has been the establishment of the Savannah Farmers Marketing Company. In these warehouses, farmers collect their harvested crops, process the seeds and sell it to the market at fixed prices. The marketing company is a critical uh, driver in, the, uh, in improving agriculture. One, because it provides farmers with a ready market. Two, it improves their income. And with the improved income, they are able to invest in improved technology. So the, a marketing company is a very, very important driver uh, in the whole uh, improvement of the agriculture system in the, in, 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 for small-scale farmers, at least in our part of the country. The Savannah Farmers Marketing Company was founded in 2005. It coordinates the supply chain, linking about 8,000 individual farmers to both local and international buyers. Well, Savannah Com uh, Farmers Marketing Company buys, aggregates produce from small-scale farmers for onward sale to agro-processors in the various uh, crops that we deal in. We buy I, uh, crops like soya beans, sorghum, granules, and cashew at the farm gate. We clean, we sort, we bag, grade it, and then sell to agro-processors on behalf of the small-scale farmers. The farmers now stand united and are cultivating their land in a much more efficient way. They jointly contribute to the future of their farming cooperatives. This is a result of the Savannah Farmers Marketing Company, as well as training funded by the Dutch NGO, ECO. In the village of Kapashia, for example, plowing with oxen has increased revenues. Because Adopting a business approach to farming has improved the livelihoods of many farmers in northern Ghana. They now work together, invest in new equipment and are educated in farming and management. This means that they can be considered successful entrepreneurs.